Hey, what's up, my fellow YouTubers? Welcome back to Rocket League, and we have Summer Ro Rocket League X Cybertruck presents Summer Road Trip, uh, a new special event. And I don't care. I'm unironically, you know, using this when I unlock it. Uh, the Tesla Cybertruck is making its ele electric debut in the Rocket League arena. Complete challenges releasing on the 26th. And the, and the 31st of July to unlock the full set of items. So this, the rest of the challenges are not available yet, but there's one challenge I can do right now. So yeah, what what I mean is uh, I don't care about driving this. Basically, everyone in the world is against this vehicle being in Fortnite and Rocket League. Like, using this make, makes you a, a gigantic target. Basically, which I don't care, you know. I can be fun to use and and funny enough. It'll be more functional in game video game form than form than real life. So yeah, the only challenge I can do right now is play eight online matches during summer road trips. So I'm I'm gonna be doing that after this recording, and you get the freaking. Cybertruck wheels that looks like something you see out of Red Faction Gorilla or a 80s sci-fi movie. So yeah, other challenges use thanks and quick chat in five times in five matches. Get 500 more points in a single match, which which I'll try to get and play one online match. Right now I'm using what? Let's see. I'm using the Nimbus, you know, this nice kicking design I have set up here. I'm gonna find a match, uh, competitive, so I'll see you in a bit. <clears throat> okay, here we go, match of the episode, and, uh, as I was saying, everyone's against the Cybertruck, you know, existing now. Uh, in Fortnite and freaking Rocket League. I don't give a, I don't give a shit, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna use it when I unlock it, and it's going to be fun. Uh, I'm, st like, basically, because I've been a fan of the Tesla, uh, manufacturer for a long time now. Like, basically, I have almost every Hot Wheel, except, the uh, separate truck. So, yeah. Uh, you know, I just think Cybertruck, like, Tesla is cool, like, the first, like, the first, like, ma like, mainstream, you know, electric car brand, and I always thought that was awesome, you know, but now every other brand um, is coming up with their own, you know, electric vehicle, EV vehicle, so, yeah, like, awesome, like, the, like, the future is happening, so, yeah, uh, Shame, <clears throat> shame, you know, that the Cybertruck is garbage, like, garbage in real life, like, ba like, like, the, the most, you know, broken, you know, like, vehicle in the market right now, like, it's so, like, dysfunctional at the moment, <clears throat> that it's, that it's dangerous to use the Cybertruck, basically, so, yeah. And also, I see the point, like, that it's kind of, like, risk, kind of risky, uh, using the Cybertruck in Fortnite because, uh, <clears throat> basically because the, track, the whole front end and the roof is basically, uh, uh, I was trying to avoid that copyright. Like, it's the massive windshield that goes the front all the way to the roof yeah it's not not hard to miss you know miss you and not hard to miss anybody you know in the driver's seat at all so yeah i can see why like people really don't want to use the cyber truck you know with that you know flaw in game and and it's in the Cyber Trek being huge, you know, I can see why. Like, why it's not the best vehicle to use in game. So, yeah. 
Fuck you, so I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this, the rest of the matches I need for the, uh, I'm gonna try to do the rest of the matches that, for the, for the wheels, and I'm, uh, I'm gonna jump them to Fortnite, uh, to do the Pirates of the Caribbean and the summer stuff there, and so yeah, I'm very busy, so, I can't do Siege at the moment, it's going under maintenance uh, by the time I'm recording this. Uh, so yeah. I'm just gonna relax with... Uh, uh, I'm just gonna relax uh, with GTA after that. Yeah, try to get, like, grind some money on there just for fun <clears throat> before I do single player stuff on the PS5. <laughs> nice. <clears throat> Good thing, uh, freaking the blue team got us screwed on freaking team members. So yeah, uh, that, uh, oh, that's right now. X Defiant, so yeah. Just wanted to do a quick, you know, Rocket League video uh, about the summer event happening right now. And good thing this hybrid truck is free. I, I thought it was a premium vehicle, you know, when I first found out about it being featured in uh, these games, you know. So, awesome. Saves me the money because my memberships are due soon on Xbox and PlayStation. Uh, more rambling. So, let's see. Yeah, I'm trying to relax right now. Also, I got to play... I got to I got to play outdoors. Uh, technically, I, I had the freaking projector. I got to use the projector... Project... Projecting... Uh, projector screen or whatever. I'm trying to say. Uh, the arcade went up. Projector, uh, freaking model. I got to play a few, uh, that lets you play a certain, uh, Nam a few Namco classic games on a freaking projector, and I had, and there's a screen on the side of my house fence, uh, which basically, like, like, it was awesome playing games, like, outside, you know, on a big screen, like, Outside in a nice, you know, gazebo tent. I played Pac-Man and Rally X for a while, and after that, I plugged in my Steam Deck and played a couple of games there. But sad disappointingly, I couldn't uh, play anything online because my Wi-Fi range uh, it's not the best when I took the Steam Deck outside, you know, to that gazebo tent, like... Like, I tried to play Left 4 Dead, uh... As soon as I start Left 4 Dead, I would just lose connection, so... Made things... So I couldn't play Left 4 Dead at all. And... So I was with the Steam Deck outdoors. I basically had to play games that had zero internet connection. Like, strictly a single player. So yeah, I couldn't, like, do much with the Steam Deck outdoors until I get a Wi-Fi, like, a, a Wi-Fi extender or freaking booster for outdoors, so yeah. So excuse my rambling, I hope you enjoyed this episode, see you next time.